you were a zombie in Warm Bodies. Now mm -hmm. talk about an acting challenge. I think being a zombie must be very difficult. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it had its upsides. I didn't have a lot of lines to learn. Um, oh, that's true. I didn't yeah, think about yeah, that. Yeah, so it was easy in that you sense. You can just mutter and moan most of yeah, the time. Yeah, it was kind of, you know, what, <laughs> yeah. One of my friends was laughing about it. He was like, you know what? It's kind of the easiest role you've probably ever had to roll, like an uncharismatic, pale guy who moans a lot and, and slouches when he walks. He was like, you didn't have to do anything for that. Yeah, yeah. Um, so you thought, like, okay, that's pretty easy. Yeah. What about, there's a lot of uh, technical stuff when you're playing a zombie, like, you have to, I'm sure it's a spe this great special effect they have, but you have to eat people, you know? Yeah, and I, don't, I never understand how that works. Like, how does that work? Well, that, that was, the, the, I mean, the main brain eating for me in that was, uh, was Dave Franco's brains. Um, and he, he didn't want to do it for real, for whatever reason. So, <laughs> they, um, he chickened out of that, Yeah, huh? what a wimp, Didn't right? want to do it. Um, so we got this dummy uh, that looked not really much like him, to be honest, and I would, I would crack its head and then I'd peel its skull off and eat his brains. Um, which was really fun, apart from the one time when... Um, and what when, is the brains made of? Is it made of like marzipan or yeah, candy? it's like a soft cakey sort of thing in there. It's quite sweet with lots of fake blood. Um, but it's tasty. Yeah, no, it's tasty, apart from the one time when the dummy's hair got pulled off and it was mixed in with the brains. Hmm. And I sat there and I looked hmm. at it, I saw it and I was like, I knew it, take, I knew it took a while to reset this, this skull, so I thought, you know what, I'm just gonna eat the hair. What? <laughs> so I, I ate it, I don't know why. It was, no, it was no, disgusting. that's where you say cut, there's hair in the brain. Yeah, I know. We gotta reset and do it again, I'll be in my trailer for well, 17 the hours. Thing, but with... <laughs> Getting a massage yeah. and watching football, that's but, what you do. Yeah, I know, I, I felt as though I was taking one for the team. I was like, if I do this, everyone can go home early and, and they won't be stuck here for another half hour or whatever. So were they proud of you when you just ate like six pounds of hair? No, I was like, I was like quietly heroic. I never, I never mentioned it till now, so hopefully <laughs> now I'll get lots of messages being like, well, you're amazing. <laughs> I don't think you'll get one. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> not. Uh, I know that you were uh, just in Africa and you tried, did you try skydiving for the first time in I Africa? I did, yeah, yeah. Uh, I've never, you well, know. I got we, a story about that. Go. Did and, you hear about this guy that went up 24 miles? Oh, for God's <laughs> sake. Oh, oh, you were watching? I'm <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry. You, uh, you, you, you jumped out of a plane. Yeah. For, I've never been tempted for a second to do that. Oh, I was, I was terrified throughout. And I, I spent the whole morning thinking I was doing everything for the last time. So I was brushing <laughs> my teeth and I was like, this is the last time I'll clean my teeth. And then driving in the car, I was like, this is the last time in the car. And then I got, I got there <laughs> and they, they, they showed the different jumpsuits they had lined up. And there was one in, uh, in tiger print, like a onesie with tiger print <laughs> with, the, with a little hood and little ears and everything, and I, I sat there and I looked at it and I was like, that's the one, that's the one I did. I was like, if Why, I, why that well, one? In my head, I was like, you know what, if I am gonna die today, at least then everyone you know, who knows me can be like, oh, it's a shame he died, but at least like, there's a funny kind of morbid twist on it. Yeah. And like, they could have, like, at the funeral, they can have a little laugh, it's like, oh. Yeah. Such and, a Nick thing to do. Yeah, and also, and also kind of think like, you know, you know, not feel so sorry for you. Yeah, the yeah. man dressed as a tiger. Well, we, I think we have a picture here of you. There you are. <laughs> wow. That's fantastic. Yeah, I didn't have the hood up then, but it did have little ears as well. It's very cute. Uh, I want to make sure we get to this Jack the Giant Slayer. Yeah. And uh, uh, the, the uh, special effects look fantastic. There's no brain eating for you in this. No, no, no. This is me running around swashbuckling right. um, with these fantastic Bill Nye. He plays the lead, lead giant. And, and they did motion capture and there's amazing special effects in it. It's, it's, it's odd seeing a film like that because most of the stuff isn't there when you're there. And then suddenly you see it and you're like, it's wow, your, You're just a... uh, acting on a green screen. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna do the talk show like that someday. Just, it's all gonna be done you from my- You do it from home. Yeah, I'll just do it from Indeed. home and Andy will do it from his home and Kevin will be at his home and we'll just all beam us in and we'll Perfect, do the show. It? That in would fact, be great. That's a great idea, Conan. <laughs> no, it is. I think it's a good idea. Yeah, yeah. I think it's a great you're idea. You're not invited back. <laughs>